So then we are back with more understandings from the time of the Second Tabernacle Services where we find in the Aramaic English translation of the word. This translation comes from the original manuscripts of the prophets of the Itzayelic lineage. So then we understand the understanding of the time of the end, per Yerushiahu, the 61st chapter, where then Yerushiahu the prophet explains the time of restoration of the cities laid waste for many centuries. Those cities were then the places where the Messiah, prior of his ascension, said, Go therefore around the world and form holy cities. Tabernacling, or then second tabernacle services, then because of the first anointing, came for this purpose until a thousand and nine. After a thousand and nine came the thousand years of deceit, as you read then the twentieth chapter of Revelation, but you can't go by number. You have to understand by times and seasons. So then, during this time where the nations are preparing themselves for the future decisions coming from the hands of the Ishmaelites, and the reason why, it's because the restoration period relates with the first contact with the Creator and the first human being in the earth, namely Ibrahim. So the decision making after 2009 or 7009, they must and will be from these understandings. However, until Arabia, then obviously because the most prominent Ishmaelic center where most of the oil is located at, then we understand the decision making later when the Chinese system then is implemented. So far we can expect not implementation until the next 36 months. Because then what we have heard in as far as then the IMF reports a couple of years ago, then they said our monetary system would not last for more than five years. A couple of years already gone. We understand we have 36 months to get our system outside of the paper money system. In other words, rather than generating paper money to make up for the deficit, the banking system, private institutions, should have a systematic, computerized line of gathering of taxes instantly, real time. So then, when the system of the Chinese comes, then there is a hold of in the system, and then they can gather taxes from. If this area does not get done, the situation becomes very detrimental. The reason? Because those private institutions, financial institutions where you can send and receive money, international, those then are going to be intact. And the government then can't take taxes from, because they have to go through then the obstacle of privacy. But then through these close the circuitry of financial institutions, then you have this system where you can buy, you can have it for sale, and you can receive funding in a closed circuitry. The government can't be nosing around, so to speak, and then try to remove taxes because of the privacy regulations. So then the government finds itself in a position where nothing they can do at the moment other than working through then the Federal Reserve and coming up with a team over there and then starting up these real-time instant taxes gathering every time there is earning. Then has to be also specified for instance, if you are paying an item, has to have an ID of payment. When you receive, you receive an ID of receiving. When you are making a regular payment, has to have an ID of a regular payment. When you pay, for instance, a mortgage, ID payment of a mortgage. When you buy a car, ID payment of a car. 
when you are buying a product overseas, you buy a product under an ID, buying a product international. When you receive funding from the international, whatsoever category does not fit on those specifications previously stated, then you understand those are earnings. That's when then the government takes tribute or taxes from. So then when they target every area other than coming of funding, then becomes a whole lot easier to understand what is pure profit and what not. However, this has to be for every segment of the entire country's transactioning systems. Very important doing this because then when the Chinese system comes, though they have their own system, and so far is mostly a mystery. It in quote the ace card of the Chinese. But we understand the principle because when you buy a product from China, it costs you 10, you pay them with a private closed circuitry of payment fund. The government is not linked with it. So you pay them and you receive the product at no charge for freight. So then, this circuitry, when it's tracked, then you are able to get taxes from. Because this private institution is going to be linked with the Chinese system. So then, when the government is able then to get taxes from the system, then whatsoever comes through it, it is then taking taxes. And then maintains the government working. So then as many as financial institutions with a closed circuit, the government has to come up with a computerized section of it where they can have their taxes taken from. Real-time taxation. So this truly comes then the objective of Mr. Bernanke. He's the person in charge of the Federal Reserve. He has to come up with the system. How is he going to do it? We don't know, but it has to be done. He has to search around, find a team, work through and make sure the system works perfectly. Because it's exact. So then when the Chinese system comes, then the ID or every time there is a transaction, they understand sections of these transactions with a specific ID of payment of a mortgage or payment of a car, payment of a house, payment of a boat or loan of some sort to pay. Each of those areas must be specified in ID. But then, if the government does not do the work, and if they hide behind the printing machine, in 36 months, the paper money won't be valid. This is the problem that we are facing. They don't understand this viewpoint yet because they are not aware of the Chinese system. They are not aware of the relationship with China and the other side of the world in how they do trade. Our trading system is very archaic, very old, very outdated, obsolete. On the other side of the world, since our politicians, they don't go over there, they don't take a trip over there, they don't inform themselves, they simply hide behind the printing machine and they get very comfortable and they go through the humdrum every day thinking because of their behaviors, then some sort of miracle is going to take place in the future. Because they are lazy. There is no other word using it. They are lazy. And then fights of Democrats and Republicans. The main factor in the movement of the moment is in the hands of the Creator and it can't be changed. 
what has to be done is coming up with this new system where they get taxes real time. Whether if a person is then legal or non-legal, that's not the point. The point is, if a non-legal person is doing the work for a legal person with understanding of computerized systems and then the government is taking taxes from, it's not that important if a person is legal or not. Though, should be taken care of, but then the naturalization services then take care of it. That's their job. The situation our governments, a lot of people they are mixing up themselves, fixing up then job descriptions and nobody's doing the work. They don't understand job descriptions. At the moment, Mr. Bernanke must come up with this system. It's his objective. If he doesn't do the job, he has to get out of there and then give somebody else then the leadership to get the job done. Same with the president, same with the vice president, same with the, the House of Representatives. If they don't do their job, spare job description, they have to get out of there. There is no more club of friends. They have to come up with this system precisely removing taxes real time. And they thought they were smart. They are not smart. They are going to a cave. Watch the future of the government. They are building the Ozarks over there. A huge place. 72,000 squares. They are going to a cave. The government is not smart. But then, job description is then the Federal Reserve chairperson is then doing the work. Or wallowing around, they stare at each other with faces like stupid, not knowing what to do, expecting a lightning bolt from heaven to get in their rears and then to put them to work. No, they have to understand their job descriptions and do what they must. At the moment, the computerized system taking real taxes, real time, instantly. This is what is required. Then generating more electricity for the grid. Then revitalizing our industry. And the government wastes time, oh, it's sequestration and blah, blah, blah. And because I have to save so much, you know, in the system and tax cuts, it's not important. They are acting at, during the time of the thousand years of deceit, the humdrum, junkie, lack of directives from the past. It's no longer. When we read Revelation, or Galah, the third part of the ships, eighth chapter of Galah, Revelation. There is a nation over there, as you understand from Daniel. Daniel and Revelation, they are linked. Daniel, the statesperson, indicated at the end of time, knowledge would increase because there is a nation taking the leadership, as was then Babylon. And then the Medes and the Persians. From far away, Daniel, China is over there, they are taking the leadership of the production. And knowledge would increase. So what is the objective? Coming up with this system, real-time taxation instantly. 